Yo, what's up everyone? My name is Andrew Warren, and in today's video, we're going to be doing our daily transparency update as usual. And with this transparency update, we've had an amazing day for Tesla stock, for Elon Musk, and for my portfolio. With that being said, a lot of things to be excited about. This was an absolutely amazing day for Tesla stock. It seems like we haven't seen this huge of a day in terms of movement for quite some time now. Even though Tesla stock has been performing extremely well over the past couple of months, it still seems like we haven't seen as huge of a surge like this in a decent amount of time. Of course, there's been some days where we've had plus 5%, plus 6%, even plus 7% in the normal market hours. But today, it kind of throws it back to early early 2020 almost around this time period when we were seeing tesla stock at like plus 12 percent plus 18 percent and even around some of those days after the really significant movements at like plus 12 percent or plus 18 percent or plus 22 percent we had the following days kind of similar to what we saw with today at around plus eight percent plus nine percent and then if we count after hours that's around plus 10 percent as you can see on the side here plus 9.69 percent for tesla so like i said this has been an amazing day we had elon Musk becoming the richest person in the world at least on paper in regards to the ones that we have transparency about so elon musk has passed jeff bezos from amazon as the richest person in the world what we've seen with tesla stock recently i think has caught a lot of people by surprise just because we're starting to see even more of a surge after s p 500 inclusion than some of the movements that we are seeing around that time period like i said we've had some really good days around that time period of s p 500 inclusion but those days seem to be more of in that six percent plus five percent sort of in in that range there where it's a pretty significant surge but it's not as significant as like the one that we've seen today where it's at around plus 10 percent in total so today's been a really impressive day for tesla stock and of course as always if you enjoy the tesla videos please make sure to smash that like button but just getting right into this one for today tesla stock performing exceptionally well the arc invest kathy wood prophecy has come true what we're seeing right now is over four thousand dollars in pre-split values for tesla stock which was actually a price target mentioned by arc invest Kathy Wood way back in 2018 on CNBC. So we have already exceeded this price target and this was something that a lot of people laughed at Kathy Wood for. They thought she was crazy saying that Tesla would eventually be worth $4,000 per share sometime in the future based on her price target. That seemed pretty crazy for that point in time to a lot of people, especially the mainstream finance media. And I have to be honest, I just love someone who is bold enough to go on TV or go in front of an audience and make a claim, back it up with evidence, and then be proven correct in the future and then that person who was originally perceived as crazy ends up being realized as not that crazy at all and that's just a situation that i love to see because i always have a lot of respect for someone who has conviction in something and they're willing to go against the grain to present their ideas and explain why they think this is a certain way or why they believe this and especially when that truth comes to fruition and everybody realizes that this person was correct so i have a ton of respect for kathy wood and this is a very big day for her and her credibility because it has come true much sooner than even expected and just regarding the details of this prize target it was for 2024 and since then it has been upgraded but i just wanted to take note of the fact that this has actually come to fruition not only does that leave us exactly at four thousand dollars per share pre-split but it is currently over that which would be i just did the math i believe four thousand one hundred forty five dollars for a tesla share right now pre-split if it wasn't split into five different shares basically to get that number all you have to do is multiply the current share price by five but just getting right into the portfolio update for today we are currently at a value of three hundred forty $32,074.87 and I'm just absolutely mind blown by today all day long it seems like I've had a hop in my step and to be honest I have been checking Tesla stock a lot today just to see if we were going to see this style of a trend where it starts out pretty bullish at the beginning of the day and then we have that slow kind of linear movement upwards or if it's one of those days where it starts out pretty bullish goes up a little bit and then we kind of have some volatility until the end of the day and then it kind of starts to dip in that last hour so I was pleasantly surprised to see Tesla the stock continue to go upwards rather than sort of dipping within that last hour of the day and it's even greater to see it going up in after hours however we still have tomorrow until 4 p.m to lock in that share price movement 
But like I said, regardless, in the normal market hours today, thankfully, we were able to lock in a really good price and pretty much lock it in around the peak of the day, around the highest point of the day. So that's really the best way that a stock market day can turn out for you is when it starts out pretty high, continues to go upwards, and then ends basically on the highest point of the day. So I'm just really thankful for this movement for today because we got a really nice lock-in price at the end there, and then we also have it going into the green in the after hours. So just addressing that normal market hours movement, we had a plus 8 0.61% gain. That is plus $26,657.31. And then in the after hours, we had a plus 1.75% gain, which is plus an even $5,872. And the after hours are currently closed right now, so the market is at a standstill. But just addressing that movement, as you can see, over $30,000 in gains today. I believe when I checked it yesterday, we were at around $309,000. So we had a tremendous movement for today. And just to see us making $30,000 in one day at around a 10% gain, that in itself just keeps me so motivated when it comes to investing. And it makes me want to just keep on putting as much as I can into the market, or at least just some sort of investment. Because this is a pure example of the fact that when you start to grow your portfolio to a certain amount, even the movements like plus 10% or even plus 5% or plus 2%, they can start to become very significant when you compare it to like your normal income or what you would earn in a typical day at your normal job. And this is why I always say investing is one of the greatest decisions that I've ever made because there's just no way that I can make this amount of money in a normal job day compared to like what I'm making here with investing. So even if it's just chipping in $20, $50, $100 here and there and just slowly building up that portfolio, it can get to this point. And that's one of the main reasons that I do these videos videos is to keep people motivated when it comes to investing and to really put that message out there that investing is really that lifeline for a lot of people even with someone like myself I'm not like a super rich person that had hundreds of thousands of dollars to throw into the market yes over time I've been able to build up around a $100,000 investment in the market but that has been over years and years and years of working around like 22 23 years of my life working up to get that $100,000 and to put it into the market I've been working gradually towards this but this is just one of those examples where it is possible to be a normal person and just invest aggressively in the stock market and make solid financial decisions in terms of picking the correct stocks. Of course, anything that I see in this video is not to be considered financial advice. This is me just simply sharing my thoughts and experiences. But like I said, I just want these videos to be motivating in the sense that it shows that a normal person just like me can actually start to build their wealth significantly if I keep at it and if I continue to invest and if I make good decisions like how I've made with buying Tesla stock. And I've just so thankful to have gotten so far with a portfolio in a short amount of time and addressing that time frame as well just to show you all and have that transparency as always for the past week we are currently at plus 16.61 percent that is plus 48,721 dollars and eight cents for the past month we are at plus 33.74 percent that is plus 86,296 dollars and 52 cents for the past three months we are at plus 103.74 percent that is plus 174,180 dollars and 28 cents for the past year we are at plus 228.78 percent that is plus 238,029 dollars and 60 cents and then finally for the all-time chart we are at plus 233.26 percent that is plus 239,000 $428.49. As I addressed earlier, this was one of those days where it started out pretty bullish and it just continued on upwards until the end of the day and until that after hours close. Pretty much this whole chart here is a consistent move upwards from the left to the right. This is what I consider near an ideal day in the stock market. I guess you could say an ideal day would be where we don't have this kind of little dip in the middle right here where it's basically just a continuous move upwards. But really, this is about as good as it gets. And in terms of addressing the share price and the possibilities towards the future, I really wouldn't be surprised if we hit $900 per share sometime soon in the future, just because I don't think there's a lot of people selling their shares right now. I think one of the major reasons that we've been seeing such a run-up recently is that no one is willing to part with their shares. Even if Tesla stock hit $1,500 per share tomorrow, I would not be considering selling my shares just because you have
have that hassle of the taxable event. And I think there's also just a lot of people that have gotten to the point where I am, where they've made such solid gains, there's really no point in them cashing out because it could drop like 20% and it still wouldn't affect them. They'd still probably be in the green. And I think that's another major factor as well. If you've already made some really nice gains on Tesla, there's probably a lot of people out there that are giving themselves a bit more leeway when it comes to holding it just because they're in the green so much. They may not be considering panic selling like they would be if they weren't so far into the green. And I think that could be a factor as well. But like I said, I think a lot of Tesla investors in general, they just don't want to part with their shares because most of the people that are buying at this point in time, we know that we are paying a premium. And the point of buying right now is to hold for the long term. We're talking like 10 plus years in the future, sometime 2030 or sometime past 2030 that people are looking to hold because they know if they are going to buy the shares right now, they're going to be paying a premium. And to justify paying that premium, they're likely going to be having to hold for a long period of time. And I think that's one of those things that works out as a favorable position for Tesla because for those investors that are holding it for the long term, we keep that supply low while the demand is high and while people are excited about the company and they see the progress happening with it right now with them recently just hitting that near 500k delivery number as predicted by Elon Musk in 2014. So I think there's just a lot of people that want to buy the stock right now. But on the other hand, the people that own their shares, they're not even considering selling regardless of where that share price goes in the near future. And that's kind of the position that I'm in as well. I'm not going to be considering selling my shares whatsoever. Addressing Tesla stock specifically, as I stated in total, we had a plus 9.69% gain today. That is plus $32,529.03. So a really nice gain for today. And then in total for Tesla, we are at plus 150.07% which is plus $220,878.02. I just wanted to do another quick little portfolio update as usual, as today has been another huge milestone day for Tesla and Elon Musk specifically, and this portfolio as well. So as always, of course, please make sure to smash that like button if you enjoyed this video. Definitely feel free to check out my referral links in the description below. You can get a free stock with Robinhood right now, and you can get some free stocks with Webull as well. Definitely feel free to check those out because it's basically nice passive income with minimal effort, and it also helps support the channel, which I I really appreciate it, but I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week.